I paid Micah Morris for some coffee. I absolutely love coffee. Coffee review. Dude, Clipper coffee hits different. I have a drinking problem with coffee. Starting out with just one cup a day, moving up to two cups a day, to three cups a day, to four cups a day, to back down to two. So the time came to pay Michael Morris for some coffee. So I head over to his website, look at the website, definitely don't want decaf, so it was time to purchase the Micah Morris coffee for an ultimate Luke PV coffee review. If you guys are new here, my name is Luke PV. Welcome to my channel. Like, subscribe, most importantly, hit that notification bell because bangers every week. So as we sit around and wait for this coffee to actually get here because I just, I literally just purchased it. Five to eight business days. I can't wait that long. <gasps> the coffee has been purchased. Drinking the same old cup of coffee that I have right now. How long is it gonna take? Well, I'll let you guys know. Total cost me $28.90. You know, 28 bucks is actually pretty expensive for a bag, but now we wait. Waiting on some coffee. Is it any different than any other coffee? We're gonna find out if it is. Day one, got my regular coffee here. Let's read my scripture. How many days is it gonna be? Day two, we have an update. Our coffee is shipped. So, one last day without the Morris coffee. I can almost taste it. Actually, I can't. I can't wait to taste it, is what I actually meant to say. Guys, it is day four without the Micah Morris coffee. Um, I think I'm drinking Genovi right now. That's what it's called. You know, I'm gonna give a rating on this one because I haven't given this one a rating yet. You know, it's, it's not like man that's good 7 7.4 7 7.5 you know it's good solid day-to-day -day coffee and sunday morning i get to go to church i'm ready to go <sighs> only a few more days when's it gonna get here you'll find out day four or day five i can't remember still drinking the coffee at home still haven't got it maybe it'll come in today currently at the golf course filming the banger video five thousand dollars versus five hundred dollar golf clubs in the meanwhile I love coffee. Another day. Don't have the Morris coffee just yet. I'm expecting it, I think, tomorrow or today. I don't know. I haven't looked at the shipment, so. Headed to the golf course early in the morning. I've been really grinding because I got some big matchups coming up, so your boy's gonna be ready. The package has been delivered, and ironically, today is actually Tig's birthday. So, happy birthday, Tig. Thanks for the birthday present to me. Oh, I paid you, so. So let's open this bad boy up. Let's just let's just look at it. Just straight off here. Dang. Okay, so this is a lot bigger bag than I thought it was gonna be. All right, let's see what it says. Cheers to going for it when you don't feel like it. To finding the hope when all seems hopeless. To chasing dreams when you're the only one who believes in them. Now go out there and get something done today. Enjoy your cup, Tig and Katie. Dang, I actually really like that. That's really cool. I was not expecting it to say that. If you're chasing that dream, some people may not believe you, but as long as you believe, Tig said it right here. To chasing dreams when you're the only one who believes in them. Chase those dreams. 2022, this is Tig's blend on Tig's birthday. This is a really cool packaging and it's a lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. Smell test first. Ooh. It smell good. Where do you get this coffee, Tig? Where do you get it from? Where do you get it from? It smells a little darker. Thanks for getting hyped for the club championship, Tig. It means a lot. Let's freaking go, baby. Tig always sits in his backyard and explains kind of his golf career and also what's going on in life for him. So that's what we're gonna do today. And a little bit about me is I started playing golf around 13 to 14 years old. I ended up playing college golf to where I had two individual wins. Our team went to the national championship twice. And I actually started my YouTube channel my, my COVID year of college golf. I had only a couple hundred subscribers. Ended up here I am today still making videos. I just love it. I love playing competitive golf and always just keeping the edge to my game. I also have a company called Sandbagger Golf Company to which I started that just one year ago and we've 
come out with so many great products just to see you guys wearing it. And if you guys don't wear it, go check the website out so you can become a part of the Sandbagger community, baby. I love my Sandbaggers. I love you guys. Everybody knows what a Sandbagger is. And I just like the name. My golfing career right now, I... Oh, getting a phone call. Maybe Tiger Woods. No, not Tiger Woods. Maybe Jack. Yeah, my golf career right now, I've been grinding lately and just getting ready to kind of do a few YouTube matchups. And Micah, if you want to do one, just let me know. This is the time of year there's not that many golf tournaments locally, so I'm going to try to find some. And my game feels really good right now. And I've started grinding more on my short game, to which is my strength, but I want to get it better. That's a little bit about me. I'm pretty sure the coffee is done, so let's go grab that, and I'll be back in one split second for the long awaited taste test of Micah Morris's coffee. Let's go. The cup of joe has been poured. Here's the taste test. This is Tig's blend from Micah and Katie. It is you too. I know you're a big part of it. You know, actually, I've my ratings have been pretty low. I think the best one I've given is Clipper Coffee. Dude, Clipper Coffee hits different. I'm gonna give it an 8.1. And Starbucks was like a 7.1, 7.4. So this is a big taste test right here. Is it better than Starbucks? Let's give it a taste. That's good. That's really good. Wow. Okay. Let me see. One more one more sip, okay? Hang on with me. This is definitely better than Starbucks. This is a tough one. So it's it's decently strong. It's not too strong and it's not too light. It doesn't have that nutty flavor that I get with some of my coffees, which I personally don't like. Let's see, um, <clears throat> So I gave Clipper an 8.1, the highest I've given so far. This is, this is an 8.0, 8.0, which is very good. I'm still waiting for like a coffee to just absolutely blow my mind to where I'm like, what the heck was that? Tig, you did good. You found the right distributor and this is a good cup of joe. Yeah, I can see myself drinking this every morning. I can see it. So that is the coffee review, guys. I like to support other businesses since everybody supports me. I, I'll support other businesses. So go check out Morris Coffee. I'll tag it below because it's good. Oh, coffee talk here. Did you guys know that coffee actually helps your golf game? Apparently, Auburn University actually did a study and they said golfers who, who drank coffee tended to be two strokes better than the person that didn't. Apparently it increases longer drives and more greens. So, hey, if you're telling me this, this bad boy makes me hit more greens, you know I'm gonna be sucking this down all morning. So that is going to do this video. A little different video, but I actually enjoyed drinking this coffee and talking to you guys. If you guys wanna become a part of the Sandbagger Club and the community of Sandbagger, check out the website below. I've been running a 10% site-wide sale this whole weekend for Labor Day. So this is Labor Day, so you guys get the 10% off. I love you guys, and as always, stay persistent. I love you guys. Let's go.